Secondary school students converged at the Prime Minister's office in Kampala for the launch of the Stand Up Shout Out Youth Association in Uganda. Dr. Hakana Rugunda noted that these will be eligible to participate in the next general election and asked them to welcome the platforms created for the youth to share their ideas with government. And as you open your hand for your ideas to go to others, you must also be ready to accept good ideas from the hands and minds uh, and brains. Therefore, the point of sharing ideas is an absolutely valid point and helps you and helps us to be better people to make a greater contribution. The State Minister for Youth and Children Affairs, Florence Nachuarachin, said that more than 3 million young people between the ages of 15 and 19 will benefit from the program. We have seen it this morning that 19 countries are here and they are doing it themselves. They call themselves Stand Out Shout Out in conjunction with UNIADA, which is a presidential uh, set up and launch initiative. So we are trying to say that let the youth speak, let them do it themselves and let them be empowered to see what is wrong and what is right for them. Stand Up Shout Out Suso was founded in January 2013 by a young Kenyan, Peter Moll, to empower the youth to realize their dreams. Dream made to help us achieve what we want in life. To help us as youth understand the positive impacts every single step we take has on our society. The director of Suso Uganda chapter in Nara Sovani, who is a student of global politics and international relations, said the youth should look at themselves as today's and not just as tomorrow's leaders. We will no longer look at the leaders on TV and wish that, that we should be like them, but we will rather be the leaders and people should look at us and say, wow, this is what we want our next generation to look at. Some of the youth who attended the launch of the program shared their views back airing your views freely like this with the government having knowledge of it it would not be possible but now knowing that i can do this it's been endorsed by the prime minister the minister of youth was here meaning there's actually a chance that what i seek can actually happen the whole point of it is to instill patriotism within the youth i'm part of the youth and so it would bring me closer to everyone else because we'll share the same ideas and we'll be part of the same solutions which we want to implement, implement for the future generations. There are serious issues battling the country but you find that the things that people want to discuss are social media. Yet we have higher issues like government prioritizing on officials' welfare yet we have unemployment and bad roads. Uganda has one of the youngest population in the world, with 77% being under 30 years. Aaron Mukama, NTV Weekend Edition.